Good Tuesday morning, everyone, and welcome back. Today, starting off a lot clearer than yesterday. We've had pretty cloudy skies over the last few days, but yesterday afternoon, things started to clear. And this morning, the skies are almost completely clear. That has also kind of dropped the temperatures down by a couple of degrees. It's 44 degrees right now in Great Falls, but beautiful clear skies this morning. Similar situation in the capital city, nice blue skies. But the temperature is a little bit chillier than yesterday morning. 46 degrees, still not necessarily cold, but we don't have that cloud cover holding in heat. So that has cooled us off overnight here. Now we have clear skies right now, but some more weather moving into our area. So this low pressure system off the Pacific coast, that will be coming in a couple of days to bring us some more severe weather. But today we have this little bit of instability kind of to our southwest, which is moving in later on this afternoon, and that will bring us some thunderstorms later on today. So you can see this area here, southwest. Western Montana, including the capital city, under a slight risk of th uh, thunderstorms developing later on. Not a huge amount, but there is the chance that we will see a couple of thunderstorms coming through that could be severe. Now the radar right now, pretty quiet, but zooming out, you can see this little bit of activity southwest of us, kind of in Idaho right now, just now moving across the Idaho-Montana border. That's what's going to be driving our weather by later on today. So we are going to see that moving in by later on this afternoon around the capital city. You can see it starting, the cloud cover starting to build by late morning. Southwestern Montana is going to see that a little bit earlier, but this is a pretty quick moving system here. That's going to hit Helena a lot harder than it'll hit Great Falls and you can see it really pushing through pretty quickly through the afternoon and evening hours tonight potentially continuing by late night. You can see these little bits of moisture kind of moving through in the late night overnight hours. So we could see a couple of storms still sticking around through that time. But tomorrow morning we should clear out for a while, but there's more coming our way for Wednesday and Thursday. Those days look even more severe with more widespread severe potential. So for today you can see that accumulation really not hitting Great Falls or much of north central Montana. Um, it's going to be a lot drier in that area, although we can't rule out the chance of a thunderstorm or two rolling through Great Great Falls. This is really going to stay in southwestern Montana and southern Montana, although not saying we're not going to have any rain later on this week in Great Falls. You can see that little bit moving through today. Tomorrow there's even more. So that low pressure system off the Pacific Coast starting to move in tomorrow. That's going to bring more widespread rainfall to us for Wednesday into Thursday and you can see that really widespread on Thursday. So we do have a couple more days of severe weather tomorrow and Thursday as well after today. A little bit more widespread for that as well. Temperatures today warming up slightly from yesterday. It was kind of a cool day yesterday. Today will be a couple of degrees warmer in the low to mid 70s. So few degrees warmer, but still with those warmer temperatures that increases our severe potential as well. So it's kind of a double edged sword with the slightly warmer weather. We do have those thunderstorms rolling in later on this afternoon and evening, and then the thunderstorms continuing kind of through the end of the week here. Saturday and Sunday should be a little bit drier, but still we have this instability in the atmosphere. So we could see a couple of pop up thunderstorms as well for the weekend all the way into next week. So it's going to be a while before uh, we see those nice dry clear skies, although should see a little bit less so on the weekend here. Could see a couple of thunderstorms, but it won't be quite as bad as tomorrow and Thursday. We've got a lot on the seven day there. Yeah, we'll be watching to see what happens. Yes. All right. Thanks, Katie.